Do you see me? Y'all know I love yakky textured wigs. This is like the hair of my dreams. Especially when they're kinky straight. I didn't expect it to look like this. Do you see this? This wig is stunning. Who is she? I'm not even gonna hold y'all. Go get the wig. Rolling out of my mouth. I'm in love with this. Is that your hair? Mm. Tell me this isn't my hair. Look at this. Tell me this isn't my hair. This looks so natural. This texture is bomb. If I got a roller set, it would look just like this. I could be somebody's rich auntie because you do what you want when you pop it. What are we flying to? First class. I feel like I just came out the salon and your girl didn't have to wait two hours to be seen. <laughs> are you here for the yak in 2020? If you're here for it, stand up. Every time I just look at myself, I'm like, God damn, God damn. <laughs> Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys, AKA Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. Tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. So today is day three of my top fave series. I have been wearing synthetic wigs for five years now, and I thought it'd only be right if I share some of my favorite wigs with you all. So if you haven't checked out my past two videos from this week, check them out. They'll be linked down below. Watch them after this video. I featured my top 10 synthetic wigs of all time, my top five $20 wigs, and now today I'm featuring my top 10 textured wigs. Yes. Save the best for last. If you're familiar with my channel, you know that I love wigs with beautiful, natural, yakky textures. I really enjoy wigs that mimic my natural 4B4C hair, including this baby right here. <laughs> So we're gonna get all into my favorites and why they're my favorites. This was a hard list to create, y'all. If you've seen my textured wig playlist on YouTube, I have 47 wigs on that playlist. So to choose just 10 was a little difficult, but I did it. And like I said with my top 10 synthetic wig video, not a strict order in this video, but do know that the wigs towards the end of the video are the wigs that I really rock with standby and I've had them for a period of time as well. These wigs I have gone out with, went to the lounge with, went to the beach with, and even through all the wear and tear, I love them just as much as the first day I bought them. So if you're ready to see my top 10 texture wigs of all time, keep on watching. All right, so my first wig on the list is by the Wiggle Collection. It's called Blowout Straight. lengths 18 inch and a 24 inch i believe i initially purchased the 18 inch in a natural color absolutely loved it it actually surprised me how much i like that wig due to its natural yaki blow out texture definitely true to its name and i'm pretty sure that wig had an elastic band in it i think that was one thing that stuck out to me because this wig is an older wig that came out years ago unfortunately though wiggle collection is only sold on wig types and i don't see the wig available in a natural color anymore Ugh. but if you want to see the video and if you want to see how i use like the tiniest bit of leave out to make it look natural you can check that out it'll be in the description box down below next on the list is a human hair wig it's by curls curls and her name is melissa <laughs> I just loved everything about this unit. Honestly and truly, y'all. I love the texture, I love the style of the curls, and I love that it came with natural layers. Like, I trimmed like the tiniest bit in the front, but that was about it. Love me some Melissa. And compared to other companies, like let's say Her Given Hair, Curls Curls is actually on the more affordable end, so I would definitely look into that company for their natural textured wigs. And another major pro I noticed about their wigs is that it actually is curly from the root. You know how at some wigs it starts off straight at the root and then it gets curly or kinky curly? No, their curls start at the root, which was game changer for me. So for that alone, she had to go on my faves list. Next on the list of my top 10 to textured wigs is actually a new wig that I recently got this year, Altre Shanice. <laughs> 
A lot of you have seen my latest Shanice video in the natural color, but I did review her in a blonde color as well. Both will, will be linked down below. And honestly, I'm so obsessed with this wig. It's kind of crazy how it's already made my top 10 faves of all time list for textured wigs, but it has. I don't care if I just bought it a week ago. Like. That wig is absolutely gorgeous. If you haven't checked out the video, please check it out and you'll see exactly why I love it. But most of all, I just think that it's a well-made unit all around. I, I honestly feel like that's the type of unit that's a perfect 10. So, Altre, kudos to you for making Shanice from the Perfect Hairline series. I mean, I just feel like my best self when I wear Shanice. Like, I feel like such a boss bitch. <laughs> wearing Shanice. She is going to be a wig that I'm going to go to over and over again. All right, next wig on my list is actually one of my wigs from my $20 Tuesday series, and that wig is Model Model Blue Metal. you the reason why i even bought blue metal is because i recently like a few months ago watched my girl the hearts and cake 90 britney i watched her review on it and i was like yo i gotta get this wig then i saw the price y'all the price alone had me sold and when i actually received the wig in person and saw how beautiful she is and at the time when i bought her sensational leticia had just come out and i was amazed because i'm like here's this wig that is literally almost a third of the price of sensational leticia yet i love it way better out the pack the style was popping put her on adjusted the parting space a little bit added my glue and i was done easy breezy beautiful such a great beginner friendly wig and for that 23 dollars price i mean you can't go wrong so that is why blue metal made my list i haven't been able to wear her as much as i would have liked but trust me i will <laughs> All right, next on my list of top 10 textured wigs is Free Tress Equal Hania. a classic let me tell you that bob is textured perfection it really is and it's in the 20 dollar price range so i mean you can't go wrong and this bob came out back in 2016 but in my opinion it competes with wigs that are out right now in 2020 when i reviewed that wig not only did i love it a lot of you definitely liked it as well and i saw it in my analytics i was like whoa i'm getting more views than usual what's that about <laughs> So I highly recommend Hania. She comes in like your basic color, so not a lot of color variety, but I do think that in a natural, in a 99J, she is absolutely gorgeous and super easy to apply. I mean, I had to put her on my top 10, had to. All right, y'all, we are down to the last five wigs in my top 10, okay? These wigs are wigs that I have worn out or about to wear out. <laughs> And I'm gonna put these in a particular order. So number five on this list is another unit by Free Trust Equal, and it is the unit FL003. When I first got this unit, I was extremely excited in that video. I remember that video like yesterday because I was so hyped. I was like, yo, why aren't there more views on this kinky straight unit? She's gorgeous. And at the time I bought her for like $27. So you're telling me for under $30, I can have this kinky straight texture that mimics human hair. And it's a long length too, because normally longer lengths would cost more, right? And she's a 13 by four frontal. 
I just couldn't believe that. Getting a 13 by four frontal for under $30, virtually unheard of. So <laughs> the fact that Free Chess was doing that at that time was beyond me and I was just in love. I wore that wig to the ground, to the ground. I wore that wig out partying, going to lounges, going to hookah bars. I've worn that wig so many times. That wig has been my go-to many a nights. <laughs> <laughs> that unit has just been so good to me. I had to put her on the list because she just really made me realize that synthetic wigs have come a long way in regards to texture and that I didn't need to pay a lot of money to get the texture that I really wanted. So remember, all these wigs are linked down below. Please check them out. I'm telling you, they are all approved by me. If you like textured wigs, if you like hair that mimics type four hair, these wigs are for you. FL003, a bomb blot texture. The only thing that I'll say about that one is that the hairline is not pre-plucked, so that is something that you will have to do on your own, but either way, she's bomb. Now number four on my list <laughs> is my outre, and her name is Jillian. <laughs> I'm wearing right now, Julie Ann. Yes, y'all, oh my goodness. Let me tell you, Outre is definitely my favorite company that sells synthetic wigs right now. Why? Because I appreciate that they are always trying to change and they are innovative. With the Perfect Hairline Collection, initially I wasn't too impressed because I was like, this hairline's not perfect or it's not even near perfect. But once they started, I guess, you know, working on the hairline a little bit more and I saw what they were coming out with, especially when they started dropping like textures that mimic my hair. Oh my gosh, I was all over it. And Julianne, she is just, even though I just bought her this year, I've definitely worn her, I don't know, six, seven, eight times already. She's definitely one of those go-to wigs for me because I love the style. I think it's just such a classic style that can be worn on any occasion. Like if you wanna just go out with friends, you can wear a style like this. If you wanna look a little presidential, you can wear a style like this, you know what I mean? It's very versatile. I think the length is perfect for every day. If you want something that's not a bob, but not too long, this goes about 18 inches on me, so yeah. And of course, Altre has an array of beautiful colors that are available now. I love this color because I think it's perfect on my brown skin and perfect for people who want to try color but are a little bit timid. Get you a Julianne, girl, and, and get this, um, ooh, get you a Julianne and get this beautiful brown color. It'll be linked down below and promise you, you will not regret it. Look at the, look at this hairline. I mean, and the way it's blending, the lace, once I added that lace tint, I was good to go. All right, y'all, we're in the top three. What do y'all think is gonna be my top three? If you're in the premiere party right now, I want you guys to type to me what you think the top three is gonna be. <laughs> because if you know me, you know. <laughs> Oh man, and I'm sure right now I'm in the premiere looking at y'all responses like, uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. <laughs> so next, number three right now of my top 10 texture wigs of all time is Zuri Sis Para. <laughs> This was my first Zuri Sis wig ever, first of all. And it was so cheap, it was like $20 at the time. And I wore that wig on every single vacation. Like at some point, if I wanted like a long textured wig, I pulled out Para. Para was everything to me. And I didn't get to purchase her yet because I just could not let go of the original one. That wig is one of those wigs that the older it gets, the more natural it looks. And it's just so, I just loved like the textured, almost bedhead look that it gave me. So I still have her. <laughs> 
and she needs to be revived <laughs> desperately but i still have her and i really want to get her again and review her for you guys probably for 20 dollar tuesday so look out for that but she's a win i wish more people knew about her i think at the time she had a few reviews but she didn't really gain traction and i also think it was due to that time period because textured wigs weren't like in the way they are in right now in 2020 so i think if zuri sis power came out now she would probably be more of a hit all right y'all we're at my top two top two and you ain't number two <laughs> coming in at number two of my favorite texture wig of all time is bella bella bounce bob if you watched my top 10 synthetic wigs of all time video you know that that wig came in at number one and that wig has been riding with me since i started wearing synthetic wigs like I love that wig to death. It's the perfect everyday wig for me. Once I cut it and style it to my liking, it was a true throw on and go. And what more can you ask for? You know what I mean? I'm a teacher and I work with pre-K students, so they're ages four and five. I don't have time for hair like this or hair going down my back when I go to work because my kids, they like to hug, they touch, they pull. I need something short and simple. The fact that it's natural makes it even better. So Bella Bella Bounce Bob, I can't recommend it enough. It's a beautiful textured wig and the price point is right. It's only $16. Can you beat that? You can't beat that. Now mind you, the texture is true cancalon fibers. It, it's dry, but for the price point, I don't care. It could be as dry as the Sahara Desert. I'm still rocking the wig, okay? So Bounce Bob has been so good to me and it lasts me forever. I mean, like I said, I wore my first one for like six months straight, period, five days a week. I know that sounds crazy, but <laughs> that's what I did because I loved it that much. All right, now we're about to close out my series. My number one textured wig of all time is... Outre Nisha 203 because she's just absolutely gorgeous to me the texture the volume the length that it comes in the style the cap construction and i also love the colors that it comes in when actually dropped this soft and natural series they knew what they were doing they knew that people were yearning for more natural textured wigs on top of that they were like you know what we're gonna go beyond the basic 30, 27, 6, 13 colors. We're gonna give you variety. We're gonna give you highlight. We're gonna give you dimension. That really impressed me. So Nisha 203 has been big. I have that wig in like five colors. I haven't worn all the colors, but I have them. <laughs> I wear the number two color and the cinnamon spice color the most. I've definitely worn those wigs out. But thanks to my Revlon blow dryer brush, I revamped them very easily. I just, you know, do, do a few passes and they're good to go. I just feel like Outre just got it all the way right with Nisha 203. And the way I felt when I first put on that wig is how every person should feel when they get a wig. They should feel beautiful. They should feel confident. They should feel like a boss ass bitch when they wear a wig. And that's how I feel wearing Nisha 203. So yes, y'all, this is my top 10, my top 10 textured wigs of all time. What do y'all think? Did you see your fave on this list? Let me know. Do you feel like I missed something? Let me know down below. Shout out in the comments. Now, if you haven't watched my videos, I've reviewed a few other textured wigs that I do like, but they didn't make the list primarily because I just didn't feel like it'd be right to say that they were my all time favorites because I haven't really been rocking them like that. Except for that Altra Shani, she snuck in the list. I, I, I don't know, she just made me feel a type of way. I had to put her on. 
But you know, of course, y'all know I love Zuri since Romy. That one's a new one that came out. Love that wig. Can't re recommend that one enough. Oh my God. But these are my top 10. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Let's talk about it. Let's have some discourse. Also, how do you feel about this entire series? Did you have a favorite video from this series? I really hope this was enjoyable for you as it was for me. So yeah, let's talk down below. And if you are new here, tap the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up. And make sure you check out my playlist, y'all. I have a textured wig playlist that features so many more bomb textured wigs. Check it out and let me know what you think. And if you want to see my other wigs from this series, the top five twenty dollars wigs and my top 10 synthetic wigs of all time, check them out right here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for joining me this week, y'all. It has been such a pleasure as always. And I will see you next time. Bye.